Alright guys, Chris here from Chris Fishing TV and um, today I'm going to be showing you the, uh, my spinning setup. This is the spinning setup that I use for bass fishing at my local lake. Okay, the rod is a Berkley lightning rod shock. It's a six foot medium heavy action split grip spinning pole. Uh, as you can see here, it's got cork grips, the split, uh, nice mounting system, complete graphite construction, one piece rod, and uh, it says right here that this rod is the uh, medium heavy spinning rod, 8 to 15 pound test, 1 8 to 3 4 ounce lure, so you can cast some pretty big lures off this thing. It has um, aluminum oxide or ceramic eyelets or guides which are good because there's low friction which won't abrade your line at all. The reel that I have on this rod here is actually one of the cheapest reels I could find but it's actually performing really well for me. This is the Shimano 1000R IX reel. Um, it was like $23 at my local sporting goods store. It has this odd drag system which works pretty well. You adjust the drag by this turn wheel down at the bottom. You just twist it like so. Uh, the surprising thing about this cheap reel is that it has full graphite construction which makes it nice and light and it just feels really nice in your hand. Uh, this reel also features the quick trigger system which just allows you to open the bale qu really quickly. So as you can see here you're holding the rod and all you have to do is reach down to this trigger and pull it and the bale opens releasing your bait. Go ahead and reel it back up here. Uh, and just a side note, this rod is currently rigged with 10 pound Berkeley Trilene rod line, the uh, XL casting, uh, Texas rigged. So I've got a sliding bullet weight here, followed by a fluorescent bead, and then an uh, offset hook attached by the polymer knot. Sorry, the uh, Palomar knot. So, just an overview on my setup here the Shimano. Um, Shimano R1000 reel. Uh, I would give it an 8 out of 10. Uh, 8 out of 10, the positives being that it's full graphite construction, so it's pretty high quality. It still has a Shimano 4 1 to 1 gear ratio, which uh, makes it nice. It has this neat little uh, quick trigger thing, which I don't really use, but it's nice to have. Um, the negatives on this reel, the line capacity isn't very good. It doesn't reel completely straight along the spool every time and I'm really not a fan of this drag system. It's uh, really awkwardly placed when you're fishing so you have to reach down here and uh, it doesn't have as much control as I would like. Another negative point about this reel is that it has um, this back turn right here. It's not solid so when you set the hook the reel actually goes backwards a little and then you get the force onto the hook. So you lose a little power off your hook sets. And another note I noticed is that while I do really like this combo that I'm using right now, although I also noticed that when I set the hook, the reel feels like it's moving in the reel seat. So that's just something to keep in mind if you plan on getting this combo. So uh, once again guys, this is the spinning rod that I use, the Berkley Lightning Rod Shock. Real Shimano R1000, complete graphite reel. Uh, this is my bass setup when I'm using a spinning reel. So this is Chris from Chris Fishing TV signing out. Subscribe and share. Thanks.